Nikola Tesla once said, a thousand years hence, the telephone and the motion picture camera may be obsolete, but the principle of the rotating magnetic field will remain a vital living thing for all time to come. These Prussian words ring true today more than ever. Magnetics is synonymous with motion in modern life. It is the magnet inside the motor that makes your electric vehicle drive. It is the magnet inside the turbine that turns wind into energy. It is the magnet inside the drone that fuels its dance in the sky. It is the magnet inside the robot that precisely guides it across the assembly line, around a farm, or throughout your home. It is the magnet inside the MRI that creates the namesake magnetic field. And it is the magnet inside the mysterious and in some cases not yet developed defense technologies that keep us safe. It is the magnet inside that matters. And therefore, our lives increasingly rely on magnets and the special ingredients inside the most powerful and efficient magnets, rare earth materials. Without these vital resources, we will struggle to progress. Unchecked progress can have devastating consequences. Earth witnessed this with our era of fossil fuels and the internal combustion engine. But this ice age is ending. Across the world, leaders and consumers are pushing industry to decarbonize. And as we all accelerate towards a sustainable tomorrow, global infrastructure is moving towards electrification on every front possible. And if electrified motion is key to a sustainable future, magnets are not just important. They are critical to our success and to our very survival. Rare earth elements are 17 chemical elements with special magnetic properties. They are not rare, but they are very difficult and expensive to separate. Well, right now, there's a single point of failure in the rare earth industry, and that's particularly crucial in the production of magnets, which are critical to so many modern technologies and military applications. The fact that 80 to 90 percent of that is produced in China right now means the U.S. economy is dependent upon the single source of failure, which no matter where that is, that provides unacceptable risks. China is very good at operating in you know, low-cost, competitive industries. They have you know, all the infrastructure around that to support it. They also have a nationwide commitment to being leaders in this industry. America led this industry for decades with this site right here at Mountain Pass. But due to cost of capital subsidies overseas in China, as well as different environmental standards, we lost our leadership and this site fell into essentially disrepair and bankruptcy. MP Materials has humble beginnings. We acquired this site in 2017. It had eight employees. It was in care maintenance. Nobody believed that we could compete against China, but we focused on execution and we slowly, methodically, over time, rebuilt this. We have nearly 300 Americans proudly working on this site. When we acquired this site, we clearly realized that multi-billion dollar supply chains don't move overnight. We had to have a long-term plan to restore this site successfully and sustainably. Our first stage, which is largely complete, was to relaunch the operations here. We now produce a rare earth concentrate product that represents 15% of the global supply. We are profitable doing so. Our next stage, which is underway, is to make separated rare earth products and optimize it to be a leader in global industry from a cost and sustainability perspective. Once stage two is done, we expect to generate a significant amount of free cash flow that will enable us to not just making separated rare earth products, but also magnets so we can fulfill our mission of restoring the full rare supply chain to the United States of America. Well, we, we know it's not a lost cause because we're doing it already. The steps that we've taken so far have proved that this company and this industry and this site can be successful. We're successfully competing against China now and we're a low cost producer in the world. Producing rare earths requires lots of energy and reagents. Depending on the type of ore processed, Rare earth production can lead to environmental challenges if not done thoughtfully, like here at Mountain Pass. Yeah, one of our goals is to produce rare earths in the most environmentally sustainable way possible. The sustainability standards that are here at Mountain Pass are second to none in the world. Generally, industrial processes, there is an environmental impact. 
but we try to make the process of making them environmentally friendly. And we do that through recycling of water, reduction in reagents, production of our own reagents from waste byproducts, energy reduction, and other means. And we believe we're the most environmentally friendly rare earth mine and processing facility in the world. We want to show that we can be not only a low-cost producer to the world, but also do so sustainably so that we don't have to sacrifice our ideals as Americans to compete on the global stage. We do have an integrated site, so from mining to processing, to producing the mineral concentrate, and then the ability to do separation all in one place is, is extremely rare. And given the scale of our operation, we're able to do it at an extremely low cost. We are focused on neodymium praseodymium, which is the key ingredient to magnets for electric vehicles, wind turbines, the true growth industries of the 21st century. Today, you know, the market for NDPR that goes into permanent magnets, it's about 35,000 metric tons globally. If you think about the electric vehicle market, that's consuming about 5% today of the NDPR market. If you fast forward to 2030, we anticipate that could grow by almost 10 times. It would be 50%. Over the next several years, we have a really exciting opportunity to transform this cash flow stream from what is really a, a materials and commodity-based business today into a growing industrial business over time. I love working here. Now, the people who are here, who are passionate about this site, who come here and put in you know, their heart and soul into ensuring that the company succeeds. Being able to support them and help them and work with them is something that I'm you know, really excited about and really proud of. I love working at the mine. They're great co-workers, we're keeping everyone safe, and we're also being great stewards to the environment. I love that our team is on a patriotic mission. Whatever your background, we all wear the American flag on our sleeves. We've overcome a lot of adversity to get to this point. But as a company, we really feel like we're just getting started. We take a lot of pride in doing something important for the country. We take a lot of pride in being able to compete globally while also being held to the most stringent environmental standards. Hopefully, MP Materials is one small example of a renewed, reinvigorated American manufacturing spirit. <laughs>